Hey y'all, welcome. Welcome back to my Sunday stream where we do a little bit of whatever I want today. We're going to be playing some more of our Final Fantasy X-2 Oversoul Run. I know it's just a couple minutes um, early today, but uh, we are getting really close to finishing this run. And then our last run is going to be really fast, so I was like super excited. We did hit 500 followers yesterday, so I want to say a big thank you to all 500 of you. Oh my gosh. Uh, now that we're at 500, also we're doing something a little bit different for subs and bits. I've got the wheel. I've got the wheel from our 400, from when we did our, our thank you, 400 thank you stream. We're going to be doing that now, every time we get a new, new sub or we get um, some bits. All right, so instead of it always being a pin, we're going to spin for, for different things. Uh, also, I'm working on planning. When I want to do my 500 follower thank you stream, we will be doing one of those. It's going to be a throwback stream, Sims and Slime. It's going to be awesome. Okay, that's really all I wanted to say. I just want to do a quick, like, hello, thank you, couple of things. Um, I want to really jump right into the game because, oh my gosh, y'all, we are so close. We are so close. We only have a few monsters left to oversoul. Uh, thank you, OBS. Okay, delay. OBS, the heck. Okay, let's go down. Yes. <clears throat> All right, cloister number 70. That's where we are. We're looking for Azidakas. Um, let's speed things up. Yes. And then, I don't know, I guess we can turn on, yeah, more frequent encounters. We're looking for the Azidaka. Should be pretty easy to kill everything we're trying to kill. Like, I really don't think we're at the floors where we're going to have issues like that yet, but we'll see. You know, we'll see if we need to, like, not have encounters on sometimes. But, like, a lot of these floors have things that we need. So, you know, we'll see. We'll see. There might be some escaping that goes on. But, yeah, we're looking for Azidaka right now. For his type, you got to kill 10 to get him to Oversoul. So we're looking for, like, 10 of those, I guess. Um, hopefully not quite as many as 10, you know. But we'll see. Oh, of course you would oversoul. Thank, thank you, thank you. Yeah, things are definitely taking a little bit longer to kill now. Definitely a little bit longer to kill. Forgot to open my LaCroix. I'm so excited. So excited. Kill more. Forgot to open the LaCroix. Okay. I need my drink. You're not an Azidaka. They, so they appear on floor 70 to 74. So for the next few floors, they will appear. I'm gonna shake it. Try shaking it. Shake, 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 shake. To get some of the bubbles out. I always complain about too many bubbles and I could just like try to get some of them out, you know? Let it fizz a little bit. Happy St. Patty's Day, by the way. Yes, I'm doing, I'm doing the green thing. Doing the green thing. I did put some green eyeliner on. I did uh, put my liner in green. I did my my eyeshadow in pink still. I couldn't commit all the way. I wasn't feeling like completely green today, so I couldn't do that. But I did do green eyeliner. So hopefully it looks like flowers. And then a green shirt, of course. That was easy. Oh my gosh! I hate how much defense this guy has. It's ridiculous. Insane. I forgot how full that was. I forgot how full that was and I just pulled it all over myself. Oh my gosh. Hole in my lip. Hole in my lip. Splattered all over. Okay. We're gonna, let's drink right this time. There we go. I can do it. Okay. More of you. God, I'm gonna start running from these guys. I'm gonna start running. Uh, They take too long. I just need to find a light, nice little spot with Azidaka spawns. I assume it's going to be a rare spawn. I assume it's going to be kind of a rare spawn. We'll see. Okay, where where 
are they on? Oh, okay. So we're almost, we're all 66, 60 to 69 for levels. Okay, where are we on abilities? Okay, working on that last 9999 one. Okay, oh yeah, I put her on the passives so she could learn those. Okay, Payne is also working on her last alchemist skill. Oh my gosh. And then Payne has psychic left to learn. Yuna has, I don't know, samurai, I guess? Samurai left? And then they'll know all the things. Oh my gosh. Great Malboro. Great nothing. Great dead. You. Once Riku learns all the things, I'm definitely putting her back on thief so that I can flee. <laughs> so hopefully she learns psychic quick. Like, my god. I need the flea. I haven't seen a Nazi Daka yet. They they look kind of, they look like the guardian beast things. They're like that, like the Xanarkin guardian beast. That we never did end up finding there. <laughs> Look at that little boss. Oh my gosh, one has to pop up eventually. Well, other than Adam and Toy, so everything is still easy to kill, so we are good there. We are, of course, cooking uh, corned beef and cabbage today for uh, St. Patty's Day, so there's that. Oh, I have something else I have to show you guys. Okay, wait. It was in the background, but I didn't point it out. Look what Levi found on Amazon. Now the cats. The cats can have a laptop, too, so they don't crawl all over mine. Look, it's got like a ball in there, right there. And then it's got a mouse for the mouse. We put, we got two. So I've got one behind me in here, in my office. And then we've got one that's um, in the living room. So we're gonna see if their scratcher is shaped like a laptop, if they'll be more interested in crawling all over that and, uh, and playing with that instead of playing with my laptop. And crawling all over it so we're gonna find out um, that'll be really they they did of course inspect it as soon as we we put it up but uh, remains to be seen if they're more interested in that than they are in my laptop so we will we will observe and report back but they seem to like it already they were already playing with the mouse and the little ball thing they did not scratch it quite yet, but we literally like just set it up like 10 minutes before I came on live for stream. So, uh, remains to be seen, but I'm hoping they will like it. Because what, what they like right now is crawling all over my laptop. <laughs> and all over my desk when I'm trying to work. Like, it's not, it's not so bad when I'm streaming for you guys, because like, that's cute. But I'm trying to do work for my day job. It's actually kind of a problem. They crawl all over everything and they want attention and they like want to climb all over my stuff and like pace around and get in the way. And it's like, oh God. <laughs> 
<laughs> so I'm hoping if I put this next to my work computer, that's why I've got it right now, like that will help. That will help and then they'll be more interested in that than they are in my work. So hopefully, hopefully. Oh my gosh, we're about to finish this floor and we haven't seen one yet. Hopefully there will be more on the, on 71. There's supposed to be 70 through 74. And even with high frequency, we haven't seen one. Well, at least we'll probably be level 99 by the time we get down to Paragon and Trema. <laughs> with, uh, with all these battles we're fighting. So hopefully that'll be the case. That'll make that way easier. Alright, well, about to jump over. Hopefully we'll have better luck on 71 looking for the Azidakas. Let's try this cloister. Oh my gosh. Didn't wasn't he oversold like the first fight and then we fought enough to oversold him again? Oh my god. Meow, hi lady. Speak of the devil. We we're just talking about you. Climbing all over my stuff. Hopefully you'll you'll climb all over your computer now. Oh, I was thinking this was going to be... Okay. So when we have to step on the three things. Meow. Meow, lady. Oh, not you. Goodbye. Get out of here. on this get rid of the tomberry in the way i don't know maybe we should run around in circles on this one on this floor and see if we can get him to appear Make sure I don't have the wrong floor for him. Am I, like running around the wrong area? Let's see. No, I'm not. 70 to 74. Okay, well. You should be here somewhere.
We're on 71. Hope you guys are enjoying the um, Final Fantasy X-2 battle music ASMR. Should be very lovely. Gets you nice and energized, woken up for the day. You haven't done anything yet because it's Sunday. This is your, uh, this is your moment. This is your moment to go do something. Seize the day. Go take that laundry out of the washer, put it in the dryer. Go unload the dishwasher. Go do that, uh, that sweeping you need to do. Whatever it is that you need to do on Sunday. You can do it to the Final Fantasy X-2 battle music. Koneko! Koneko with the first hello, my friend. How are you doing this beautiful Sunday? Oh my god. I must be doing something wrong. Like, I've had frequent battles on the entire these entire two cloisters, and like I'm just not finding one. We're gonna go down to the to cloister 72, and I think I'm gonna run around in circles when we get there. Oh shit. No, I'm not. No, I'm not, because I'm going to die right here and have to start from my last, uh, <laughs> from my autosave. Because I forgot there's a giant Tomberry here. Yep, I forgot. Okay. <sighs> Thank God for autosave. Okay, Cloister 71 again. Yeah. Okay, let's do this side first. Uh, without the, yep. Okay, we're gonna walk around. Avoid your ass. Okay, there we go. Get rid of you. Maybe maybe now that I like reset things, Ozzy Dockers will spawn. I forgot that once you get here on this map, there's the giant Tom Berries. That was dumb. Just walked right smack into his ass. I said, please stab me, sir. I would love that. Getting stabbed by Tomberries is my favorite. Doing well, I had a bad mental health moment last night, so I slept in today, and now I'm doing way better. Sometimes that's all it takes. Isn't that crazy? Like how healing sleep can be? How you can just be like feeling like, oh my gosh, everything sucks. Everyone hates me, the world is awful. And then like you go to bed and you wake up and you're like, oh yeah. Oh yeah, no, no, it's not actually. And I have coffee now. <laughs> like, sleep is so healing. Okay, I love how Riku's psychic, her psychic version, her little visor thing, it looks like she's from like future school in the future. I think that's so cool. And like Yuna's looked all like traditional or whatever, but Riku's looks like she's from future land.
feel like I must be doing something wrong. There's that oversoul Gug again. Man, when he's oversold, he dies fast. Or maybe I just got really big crits. Hmm. How am I gonna almost complete this cloister again and still not see any Azidakas? Something is up. Okay. Apparently I'm not the first one to have this problem with finding Azidaka. He will only appear in the Via Infinito after you encounter at least one in the Far Plane Abyss. Okay. So, this is the problem. This is the problem. We have to go into the Far Plane Abyss first. Oh, I think this is one, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Hang on. Let's turn encounters off <laughs> so I can find the... I think this is one where the uh, thing is... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's backtrack. Okay, yes. Okay, so... We wasted that time, but we figured it out. So we have to actually go and, uh, and move forward with beating some of the game first. So, yeah. That's why it wasn't working. I was wondering why. Like, how could I encounter so many? Okay. Made up your mind. What? We will jump in at the Bevel Underground. Are we going in? Yes, we are. Yeah, the time for invasion has come. Can I skip this? I cannot skip it. Okay. Spear Hunter Team, go in. Uh huh. Your friendly mate. Huh? Yeah. What are we called now? Does it really You know what we're called. Okay, can I skip it yet? No, still can't skip. Okay. Good point. Searching, flapping, neighboring, gold wings, attack! Whoa, such passion. Seriously? I'm so moved. We need to take him Not out of anyway. the far plane first. Let's go. The gold wings last mission. Let's do it. Hey, 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 none of this last mission business. You hear? For me, it probably will be. Be careful. Can I skip yet? Yes, I can finally skip. I knew I could eventually skip there.
All right. Let's go down. I did not, I didn't realize I would need to come do this first, but uh, yeah, here we are. So we gotta find an Azidaka down here. I think I don't encounter him until the next part, but we'll see. them in the V Infinita once you've encountered them here. There's got to be a way to do it before you get to the point of no return. And it clearly doesn't count if you've encountered him on prior playthroughs. Because we just completed Cloister 70 and 71, got to Cloister 72, and still haven't seen him. So it doesn't... Past playthrough encounters do not count for him. Child's play. Hey girl, missed you, missed you girl. Sorry I got to kill you. Hey Shiva, it's been a while, so I just wanted to kind of like update you on what I'm doing, where I am, how things are going. You know, oh. Oh. Uh, never mind. Just kidding. Party's over already. Might as well save. All right, hop, hop. Here comes the hurt. Oh, I can't, oh, shoot. What if I mix? Can I beat him up if I mix? Uh, let's do some ice gems. Uh, oh, I have lots of water gems. There we go. Psionics. Uh, let's do psychic bomb. Does any of this damage them? Yes. We'll mix water gems because we have lots of those. Hide away! And these guys have a lot of HP! Y'all die already! Get out of here! I end up using all my water gems on you. Oh, there we go. Got one. Got both. Okay. That wasn't much fun. So I can still kill them without having to change uh, dress spheres. So that's good. Oh, I don't need to mix. I can just attack you. Goodbye. Take this. <laughs> it fell backwards on pain. Pain, no. Oh, good. She's not squished. It was just pyroflies by then. Thank God. Oh, that was scary. Pain almost got squishered. Bigger fish to fry. All right, next platform. Hey 
girls. Yes, you too. It's everybody. You'll realize that at some point, Yuna. Nobody escaped. I love how, like, the far plane, like, the underworld, all that stuff is literally inside the planet in this game. Like, I think that's so cool. And it so matches with the theory of, like, 10 Spira's world being tied with um, Final Fantasy VII's world. Because in that game, like, the life stream is implied to be, like, inside the planet itself as well. So it makes sense that the life stream and the um, far plane are connected. Nice knowing you. And in the same location. Alright, last one. Hey mom, what's up? How's it going? I know things have been tough for you. But, um, I'm here now. And we're gonna hang out. Watch the soaps, all that stuff. The end. All right, those are all beaten. No, can I can I encounter an Aussie Daka before I get to that final area? Because I had thought that final area was like a point of no return, but like maybe it's not. Hey guys, what's up? Hey! Because I think if I keep going, I get to a point of no return, right? Where I can't go back?
Okay, I'm just doing some reading. I'll make sure. We might have to actually test ourselves, though. The only exception is Ozzy Daka will only appear in the V Infinitor if you'd encounter it at least once in the Far Plane Abyss. Which I have, but just not on this playthrough. So either I have to do it on this playthrough and then backtrack, or it's not on floor 70 through 74 and it's somewhere else. That's the only two possibilities. Okay, so we have saved. So let's see if after I go in here I can backtrack. I don't think I can. Continue onward, yes. I'm pretty sure once I go through here, I cannot go back. No, I can. I just never tried before. Okay. So, okay, yes, continue onward. So we're going to go fight the Azidaka here. And then... We will go back to the Via Infinito. Then he should pop up. Oh, wrong me. So I guess I had always treated this point Child of the game play. of, like, you can't go back, but you totally can. I just literally never tried. That was dumb. Okay. Um... This way? No problem. So we'll do the music puzzle. And then we should be able to get him oversold. Oh, shit. Yes, music. Music's the point. It's what worked before. Worked on all of Spira. She got gravity either. I need to take a look at um, the abilities for Riku now. What's she working on? Okay. I guess that's fine. I guess she can just like go through it. It's whatever. Okay. Oh, shit. I thought I was standing back far enough. I guess not. Bye, Mr. Malboro. Oh, this is devil. Okay. Oop, shoot.
You gotta tell me about a thing that happened in one of your RPs. What is it? What is it, Koneko? Nice work! Yeah, don't you zap me. Oh, shit. <laughs> that one's at me. Oh my god. Leave me alone, zappers. My character has some really bad trust issues and doesn't like to talk about his past. Okay, fair. Um, he's been slowly befriending this other character and he's finally at the point where he trusts her enough um, to tell her about his past. Oh my gosh! Oh, that's such a nice character moment when you can see some real growth for your character like that. I'm so proud of him. How long have you been playing him? It takes a lot of dedication because you got to find people that are willing to play with the character when they're going through like that point of their life where they don't want to like be cool. You know, it takes a lot of talent to write those early stages there and actually get them to the point where they will talk to other characters. So that's like really cool. I can't skip this scene, I remember. Remember, I can't skip it. Gipple! I got careless. Yeah, you did. Are you alright? Okay, so there's that other save point up there, and then I think if we if we climb up the other puzzle Where's without doing it properly, then we'll he encounter that Azidaka. And then he should pop up in away. the via infinito so we can I get his oversoul. Where I would wait. So that should work. Well then please take care of Gipple. You dare give me an order? I do, LeBlanc, I do. Look, we'll tell Nude you're waiting like a good girl and doing your part for the team. All right, I'm in. Knew you would be. Knew you would hey, be, Dr. LeBlanc. P. A gift from Nuge. It's from two years ago. Said it was in... I've been playing camera. this character in various settings for years, but I'll the particular friendship's been growing for about five months now. Oh, hey. five months is a while. You should watch That's it nice. Now. That's like a, such a good point to get to. Think about it. You know you won't be able to fight. And I think five months is a good time, right? Like it's not too short. Um, You're so it right. still like feels meaningful, but it's not so long that I think other players are gonna get like. What do you got in mind Tired for fun? of interacting with that kind of character before they open Any up. Any ideas, Doctor P? So that's like so cool. Me. Can I skip this? I can't even pause here. Let me skip more there. scenes, game. That thing you mentioned before. If it's for real, I want to fly it. You get to be pilot then. And maybe I'll try my hand at navigation. Then I'll be engineer. Nuge? Captain. Ah, that's perfect. You'd let an amateur be captain? 
Chill out, Nootster. All you gotta do is shut of up. Of course and they would be. You'll fit the part. Like a club. <laughs> I'll work it like dogs. Come on, get out, Bubbles. <laughs> <laughs> I love how there's such a thing as sphere selfies what in this world. To that pain? She's in Well, wait. Your captain and your Yeah, go get him, Pain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not going to do that though. We're done. I'm going to do it wrong. I always forget how to do this. Maybe it's like, maybe it's this one that I start with. Just teleport straight up. Yep, yep, yep. That's the way I go. To just skip this mini game. Alright. Alright, Mr. Boss, come here. We fight. Gosh, is he regening? Oh no, he gains health back when he hits. His hit is a drain. Okay, I see. Oh my gosh, he has so much HP. Oh no, Yuna! Oh wait, no. I should have... Okay, whatever. You made me do this. This guy is harder than I remembered. bust out the big ass attacks. Actually, regular attack, I think, did more than that. Yeah, I mean, it's good chains, but sometimes I do, like, 9999 with my regular attack on them.
I guess I should be wearing stronger dress spheres right now, but I'm not. <laughs> Shit. Maybe I should have paid better attention to that mini game. Okay. Uh, let's Mega Phoenix. I'm oh, not Mega Potion, my gosh. Oh god, please don't kill her. <laughs> oh no, okay. Alright. Uh, let's do a Mega Potion. Now's as good a time as any. I made him too hard by not, like, following the thing. <laughs> uh, okay. Let's do a Phoenix down on pain. Alright. Let's keep one of them on Mega Potions. Like that. Let's try that. so they don't ever get so low HP. Because so long as I don't let him do so many attacks, like I'll be okay. So just keep mega potioning from the stash. And this will work. Gosh, how much HP does he have? I could have definitely put on better dress gears for this. <laughs> oh, she said see ya, he's almost dead. It's gotta have less than 10k left. solved that problem, we fought one now, so he should appear in the Via Infinito for us to do the Oversoul. to where we came from. Can I just do board airship? Oh, I can just board airship right from here. Okay. Whee! All right, Bavel. I come in for you. All right. Now appear. Guess it would help if I upped encounters. There they are. Okay, that was the problem. Um, I wonder if I need to do the same thing if like he's going to be hard to beat. I'm full of surprises. Now, right in the kisser. 
I'm gonna use the same strat, and we're gonna see if he's weaker than what we just fought. Or if he's the same. Like, gonna take a while. I think this strat should work pretty well. Speed him up. Yeah, he's. I think he's the same. Oh my gosh, his oversoul is going to be so hard. Okay. We can do it. We can do it. We can do it. We might have to mascot that shit. I guess the last oversouls are going to be actually challenging. At least they'll get lots of um, AP points to finish out their skills. And we're gonna kill like 10 of these. This would be number two. like eight more times okay so that's interesting so when you've encountered him when you've encountered him in previous playthroughs it does not count
to the A to the R to the E to the N. Jane, hello! Jane, we're almost finished with this game. Can you believe it? No, you know I cry. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna, um, after this playthrough, which actually I think we'll finish, we might finish today. I'm gonna try. Um, we'll see. Some of these last oversouls seem to be like they're gonna be really challenging. But after that, we've got one more playthrough, which should be really fast. We should be able to complete that maybe even within like one weekend. Like, because next weekend, if I stream it both Saturday and Sunday, I think we might fully finish that. And uh, then I'll give my final thoughts on the game. Then we'll have to start something new. Oh, also, Jane, which you probably um, haven't seen, we reached 500 followers. So we got to plan our, um, our 500 follower thank you appreciation stream as well. Yeah, hell yeah. It's going to be a Sims party. And we're going to make slime. <laughs> Breno, hello! Welcome back! How are you doing, friend? Get it, Karen! Hell yeah, thank you. So this will be the third Ozzy Daka, so we gotta see how long until we get to the Oversoul one. I'm well about to go to bed, but saw you were streaming. Oh my gosh, thank you so much for popping in when you're about to go to bed. Uh, hopefully my stream is, is chill enough. Uh, it's not gonna wake you up too much. <laughs> so you can go to sleep. <laughs> oh shit, I'm dying. Hang on. Shit. Uh. Uh. I didn't realize pain had died. I was not paying attention. Holy crap. Uh, there we go. Okay. The March event prompts are up. Wait, that's gonna need context. I play Flight Rising, and there's always an unofficial player-hosted writing prompt challenge on the forums leading up to the end of March event. Ooh, like an Ides of March sort of thing that is, that's on the, the end of March. <laughs> Nothing bad happened to me on the Ides of March, by the way. It was a very good Ides of March. If only Final Fantasy was my bedtime story, what a life for real Jane. Some of them would make great bedtime stories. I especially think if you take 10 and 10 2 together, that would be a really excellent bedtime story. Like a novelization of 10 and 10 2 together, I think would be amazing. All right. That's our 30 Ozzy Daka down. Hopefully we don't need to get all 10 to get the Oversoul. <laughs> I hope, I hope, I hope. All right. Uh, let's see. Let's see, where are we at on Riku's abilities? I saw she just learned another. Oh my gosh, that last alchemist one takes four freaking ever. Okay, she's learning teleport now. All right. All right, we found an Azidaka here. Let's see if we can just like farm this little spot for the other ones. Considering how long he takes to beat up though, I'm like really scared of his oversoul form. Okay, so this is Ozzy Daka number four here.
kind of, there's an official side event at the end of each month except December. Oh, okay. Okay, and there's traditionally a writing challenge leading up to the March event, I think because the official event is kind of creativity themed too. Oh, that's cool. So it's not normally like a writing website. It's like uh, all kinds of things. I don't, cause I don't know what, um, what did you call it? Flight something? Flight Rising, yeah, I don't know Flight Rising. Is it like one of those browser game type of things? Like Gaia Online or whatever? In my imagination, that's what it, that's what I just decided it is. I have no idea, obviously. Don't pick on pain, God. I have Yuna healing this time instead of pain. So you shouldn't have to pick on her. My god, this thing. Flight Rising, it's a pet site. Pets are dragons, basically. Just collect pretty dragons and play mini games and write things if you're creative. Okay, okay, so I guess I sort of kind of imagine the right thing. So it is a browser game that's about pets. Remember when like there used to be so many of those on the internet and like that was the thing because Neopets was so popular and so there was like a zillion of those? I used to play a, a Pokemon one called Poke Farm. I was like really super addicted to that. It was awesome. Because you would hatch the Pokemon and collect them. And of course they had their own like Fakemon and stuff on the website. It was really fun. And yes, they had an RP section so you could do like writing and stuff about your Pokemons if you wanted to. Pet sites were the shit. It was so good. It was like the best part of the internet in the 90s and early 2000s. I miss it. I miss it so much. I know pet sites still exist, obviously, but it's not the same anymore, you know? It's not the same. They were so popular back then. Like, I don't just want them to exist. I want them to be the hotness like they used to be. Pet sites are making a bit of a comeback. I'm following a lot of development on a cat pet site, Pawboro, and it's looking really promising. Oh no, Pain is dead. Um, Phoenix down on Pain. Why the Aussie Daka wants to kill Pain so bad, I do not understand. Whether I have her heal or attack, it does the same thing. Is Pawboro live? Because I love cats. Like, if it's new, I would check it out. You know, at least give it a try. All right, that was Aussie Daka number four, I think. We need to get 10, so. Still got some more to go. PB isn't live yet, but there's a demo you can make some kitties. I'll link it in the Discord. Okay, I'll play the demo. I'll take I'll check the demo out um after stream today. That sounds fun. It's in the stream chat channel. Okay, sweet. Well, I know what I'm doing after um, stream today now. Other than eating dinner, of course. <laughs> oh, and it's raid night, so I guess I, I'm doing that too. Give me some loots out of Nomer. Oh, there's another one, okay. Um, all right, not yet on the Oversoul. So this would be number five, and he hasn't oversold yet. So we're halfway, at least, or at most halfway there. 
don't expect too much from the demo. It's literally just designing the kitties with some very basic options to see what the babies will look like. If you were to breed two kitties you made. Oh, so it, it really, it it's just character creation demo. It's not actually the gameplay. Well, if there's no, if there's no, none of the mini games or whatever, I assume will be part of it. Because usually these pet sites, like, the designing and breeding and stuff is only part of it. And then the other part of the game is some kind of like mini game or clicking game or something like that. Yeah, basically, okay. Well, tell me when it's like fully live then. I mean, I'll take a peek at it just to see if I like the designs. Um, but tell me when it's fully live when they have mini games. Cause that's like, that's how you know if it's gonna be like truly addicting or not as if it has good mini games. Or if it has like cooperative stuff, like that gets me too. Like that's why I was able to get so into Poke Farm because the way that game worked is you went around, like the, the main gameplay loop was going around and clicking on other people's Pokemon and feeding them um, so that you were like helping them out at the same time that you were growing yours. Cause the more people you clicked on, like they would see that you clicked on them and then they would be like, oh, and they would come click on you. Right, and there was like leaderboards. The more you clicked, the more you were on the leaderboards, and people would come click you. You know, because they want to click on the more active people, right? And uh, and you could only click on one Pokemon per day, so like that was the main gameplay loop mechanic. And like, oh my god, I was hooked for like months. I played it like really hardcore for a few months. It was awesome. And there was actually a couple of sites that had similar core gameplay mechanic as that. I'll tell you when the beta goes live. So sweet. I probably have a spare beta key I can give you. Oh, thank you. There's a plan for cooperative things. I think a guild D&D-ish party system. But I admit I have a hard time wrapping my head around the plan so far. I'm sure I'll get it once it's playable. Yeah, it's hard to know until they release like a real beta with the actual gameplay loop what they're going to do on these sites because there's so many different ways you can do it. You know? So, so many different ways. And they're always trying to like... I feel like all these pet sites are always trying to tr do new things. It really comes down to like the design of the animals, if those are like cool designs, and if the core gameplay loop is actually like addicting, you know? That's what you want. You want something like actually like that you can sink hours into. Come on, heal Yuna. There we go, there's the Mega Potion. Oh my God, freaking got her. Back up. All right, Aussie Daka number five down. Hopefully you don't have to do all five more. We'll find out. Okay, let's look at his abilities again. I feel like she learns a new ability like every time. Oh, that's an expensive one. Let's do Magic Guard instead. We'll do Time Trip last. Alright, give me another Azidaka. No, not quite. Hopefully the next one's oversold. We can be done. Should I run back and save since we've killed five so far? Cause I'm kind of nervous that the oversold is gonna be really hard. I think I should, I think I should run back and save. Oh shit, can't go backwards on this one. Can only go forwards. Let's see, where is a... Ah, there we go. Uh, yes. Take me back, let me save. I do not want to lose that progress. Okay.
Oh, it gave me a new Cloyster 72. Okay. That's fine, that's fine. At least we know Ozzy Dakas will show up now. Okay, is there a big ol' ass Tomberry up here? Oh, no, it's not that one. I have to go right. This way. It's gonna be the Dutch angle one. Uh, there's one, okay. Uh, attack, Master Eye, and Mega Potion Stash, okay. We got this, we got this. This is Ozzy Daka number six. I like when it lets me heal right before he does the Damocles Photon. That's nice. That's very nice of him. Well, I thought we might be beating this this round of it today and have just the one more round left to go, but <laughs> we've been going for over an hour and we still haven't oversold our first one. I guess these other ones are just more challenging. Yeah, it makes sense why I didn't fight an oversold one yet, you know? Yeah, I think we're gonna have to switch to mascots to make this light go faster. Oh my god.
killing pain. What'd she do to you? Nothing. She didn't do nothing to you. You do this to her. He should be almost dead. There he goes. You can tell he's about to be dead when um, Riku's MP gets into the yellow. Then he's almost dead. All right. Let's do this. Mm-hmm. Okay. We're going to stop trying to level, and we're going to go into our super one. Yeah, higher power. And so we don't need ribbons. Instead, we can have crystal bangles. Don't want to take off my Aaron Duke. Okay, we're gonna do. Yep. All right. All right. Now we're OP. Um, let's get Riku's MP back up. All right. Here we go. Let's wreck him. And see if we even have to heal. Now that we're gonna do a zillion fucking damage. Every time. Now I kept on Iron Dukes instead of doing in Crystal Bengals for the HP instead of doing break damage limit. Thinking like, oh, hopefully that'll make it go faster if I don't have to heal. So we'll see if that works. Or if I need to put on the um, Enterprise or whatever accessory it is that does the break damage limit. Because we have break HP limit, but we don't have break damage limit then. Let's see how this fight goes. This is number seven. Oh, and he still has an oversold. I'm trying to see if I can get away with like just healing after the battle. Meow. What's up, lady? You got things to say about this? Okay, yeah, yeah. I can just heal after the battle. All right, we're gonna do this. It's so much faster. It lets us. It doesn't let us level our additional. Um, doesn't let us level, but that's okay. What's up, lady? to give her space to jump up if she wants to. Oh, there's another. Okay. And he's still not oversold. Okay, number seven. We might have to go all the way to ten. I don't know. Oh, no, she's out of MP. Okay, let's give her a... 
Uh, oh, I don't have any mega. Okay. I just have an elixir. It's fine. I should have ethered them in between. What is it, lady? All right, I'm gonna fix their HP and MP in between battles this time, because they need it. Meow. I hear you, baby. Lady, you want to help me fight, fight the Azidakas? I hope I did those. Okay, yes. I couldn't see the buttons because Lady Booty was in the way. What's up, girl? Yeah, you can get in my lap. Cattail, cattail. Can I clean your eyeball? There, I got it. I got the eye pesky. Thank you for letting me clean that. Oh my gosh, give me the Azidaka. We've gotten seven already. Gotta be the Oversoul soon. Okay. Um, give me one second, y'all. I will be right back. Come on, lady. Calm down. Alright, sorry about that, you guys. I had to step away for a moment, but I am back. Okay. Let's try again. Oh my gosh, still no. I cannot believe he's still not oversouling. Oh, that's Riku. What is that, eight Aussie Dockers? My god. Maybe I'm gonna get like literally all the way to 10. I must have just killed an oversold one in the arena or something like that in the last playthrough. Because the counter should not reset when you do a new game plus. Oh no, I know why. It's because he counts as the same type as the Guardian Beast. And we did, like, stop fighting them after we got him oversold. So, yeah, we're going to have to get all the way to 10. So, yeah, this is eight. Well, so we have to, we do have to fight two more. Duh. I didn't think about that. Still gonna have her do the animation even though they gone? Pain, please. I 
Okay. Let's try to find two more. There's one. Did so I kill him? And then the next one should oversoul, I think. Or we fight one more and then the next one oversouls. Hello, how are you doing today? Did you get all the footage you wanted from um, from 10 yesterday? What a gorgeous game, by the way. Both the original and the HD remaster. Both really fucking gorgeous. Love them. A bit sleep hungover. <laughs> I know how you feel. I know how you feel. Do they do um, time change in your country? Do you do you do that? What a long final level. Oh my god, that's true. Do they do um, time change in your country like they do here? We did it like a week ago and I am still like so jacked from it. Like I just can't like every time, every time my schedule gets so messed up and I wish we would just stop. I don't care which way we pick the standard or the daylight savings, but we just need to stop going back and forth for real. Like, it's insane. I'm like so over it. Come on, give me another Azidaka. We're so close. We've spent we've spent uh, an hour and a half, <sighs> and we're almost about to oversoul him freaking finally. Now I know we had to do a brief aside, and that is going to save some time at the end with going through and beating the game, but still, but still, but still. I do admire your determination. Thank you. <laughs> I'm a completionist at heart. And uh, streaming makes me more likely to actually do what I say I'm going to do. You know, when I'm, and even when I'm playing games on my own, I'll, um, one, there's the Oversoul, fuck yeah. Um, I'll 100% them a lot of times, but uh, when I stream them, if, I'm, if the goal is 100% them, then I absolutely will. Like every time. I just love it. I love, like, getting everything out of a game and seeing everything. You know, with the last level of 10, something that um, that I see when I... Because I love to watch people stream it for the first time that, it, that don't know the game. And they get to the end. And I've seen, like, lots of people get stuck on that final jacked fight. Because if you don't know the game and you didn't do any of like the extra stuff, getting the ultimate weapons and things like that, it is actually kind of challenging. Eyeing Riku, why? Why? Why, sir? Why are you eyeing Riku? I don't like that. I'm not here for that. Okay, all he did was a regular attack. Hmm, I don't know. I mean, we're killing him. He's not even doing like the Damocles Photon. He, and he keeps missing. 
I don't know. Is this one of the situations where the Oversoul version is actually easier? I think it was. The Oversoul version was actually way easier. I didn't get Celestial Weapons. I just have my Aeons and Overdrive first try. <laughs> yeah, you can definitely Aeon cheese it if you don't have any um, ultimate weapons. Okay, Ozzy Daka. My god, that took freaking forever. Uh, we got one Oversoul finally, an hour and a half into the stream. The next one is not until floor 75, so I am just going to turn off at this point. I'm gonna, just going to turn off encounters, and we're going to walk down to floor 75. Um, does Possum fantasize finality? Yes, Possum does. Possum's cool. They, um, they also are getting into starting to do video essays, and um, in addition to that, they are from Mexico. Well, cheese is an overstatement, too, I mean. <laughs> True, 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 true. All right, so we need to get down to 75. So the next one we're going to try to oversoul is Omega Weapon. Um, I'm also pretty confident that when it comes to Omega Weapon, we're going to need our mascots to beat him up. So um, that's why I'm I'm keeping mascot on. I'm not changing it. We're just gonna we're just gonna keep that. We're just gonna keep that. And just like with the Azidaka, with the weapons, you have to get 10 as well. But I don't think, I don't, like, did we have to do, yesterday, did we do Ultima Weapon? No, because we had already oversold them. Okay, so hopefully it won't be, like, all the way to 10. Wait, what cloister did we just land on? Is this cloister 75? I, w I, w I wasn't looking. I wasn't looking! Okay, we'll go one more cloister down, and then we'll start looking for Omega weapons. Because it's 75 through 79. Turns my guardian angel. What? <laughs> what? Jane, why don't you play Final Fantasy games? Because you play other RPGs. Okay, this is 75. Okay, let's turn encounters back on. Let's make them frequent. And we'll turbo. Okay, there's a weapon. Okay, wait, wait. I want to... Ah... I want to do normal speed. Okay. The first time. So I can actually pay attention. But hopefully just doing just doing our big attacks with our mascots will be enough to take him down. No, I watch other RPGs. Well, I guess that's kind of true. I guess that's kind of true. What games do you play besides ESO? Oh, he dies fast. Ooh, he dies fast. Maybe I don't have to mascot his ass. Maybe I don't have to mascot Omega Weapon. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we're gonna go back to, like, leveling our, uh... Our, our dress gears that we actually need to level. Animal Crossing, that's true. You did play a lot of Animal Crossing. Okay, let's switch back. Maybe we don't... Yeah, maybe we don't need to do... Maybe we don't need to do all that. Okay, let's go back to Valiant Luster. And we had, yeah, she was learning Alchemist. And let's do, let's put ribbons back on, you know, so we can look cute. Okay, Valiant Luster, Psychic, and then switch back to ribbons. Um, yes, yes, yes. Valiant Luster, Pain was doing Alchemist. And then she needs a ribbon too. Redhead two or whatever Karen is playing. <laughs> Currently watching husband play Jedi Survivor. I watch Levi play a little bit of that Jedi Survivor game. Okay, I'm not about you. Because I have to use magic to beat you up. We already like we already did so much with the stupid protein gel. We're not fighting him. We can fight you, though. Okay, let's speed him up. Hey, yeah, you can't stone me. I got ribbons. I'm too cute to be stoned. 
I need to get into those Jedi games. Yeah, there's a lot of them at this point. I have beef with this game. What's your beef, Jane? Tell me, tell me your beef with the Jedi game. None of the monsters have been cute for like three streams, girl. We're fighting the big ones, okay? Oh, Final Fantasy. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. We already oversold all the cute ones. Okay. Ooh, oversold already. All right, let's see if we can beat him up. Um, let's do this. What if we mix? Let's do... Okay, we have so many water gems. Let's do... Let's see what happens. Okay, we can get like 44,000. Like that. Does the mix do more? The mix does not do more. We should just attack. And now he's dead. Okay, oversoul for Omega Weapon, very easy. I'm very glad because we actually need to fight 10 more so that we can get the weapons to oversoul again before continuing. We're going to need this because one of the oversouls we need to get is Paragon. And the only way to get him to oversoul is to already have the weapon type oversold when we go down there. There's no way to fight him over and over. He only exists down in the, um, as the boss at the end. Oh, have a good dinner, Koneko. The enemies are heartbroken because you just called them ugly. <laughs> these guys, okay, these guys know better. The enemies in this game are gorgeous. The enemies in this game are gorgeous. So I understand what Jane is saying. Like her standards are just very high. Okay, so we gotta fight enough Omega weapons that, that it oversouls again. Is this one where attacks don't work? The regular attacks. Oh, key cards against Master Eye too. Oh my God, just escape. Just run away, who cares? Uggo, this one's not an Uggo. This one's kind of an Uggo. I'm sorry, Jane. We're just at the point where all the monsters are scary. Like, it's it's the end. Koneko, you better be having corned beef and cabbage for dinner. I don't know if they, if they do that. I don't know if they do that over here like we do for St. Patty's Day. <laughs> Okay, what has this been like? Two or three more Omega weapons? I don't know. We gotta get him to Oversoul again and then run away. Okay, maybe we will finish this today and Ozzy Daka just took forever because it's special or something. Because Omega took, like, no time at all. I hope we can have good luck on the next one. <laughs> ah, the next one is Chalk. <laughs> As a boss. So we gotta get past her. I do not know what her uh, Oversoul version is like. So we shall find out together. If she's way harder or way easier as Oversoul. Jane, you'll like the you'll like the next boss that we've got to do for our oversoul. Because I remember we like the we like the next design that we'll see. Oh no, not you. 
Go away. We do not fight gels here. We're already done with those. Never again. Oh my gosh, what happened to all the weapons? We were getting Omega weapons, no problem. I guess I moved on to an area that doesn't have as many. We'll do circle technique on the next uh, cloister, I guess. Oh, here we go. Here's another. Goodbye. Try to run around right there, where one popped up. me. He keeps trying to squish me and he's like so wrong for that. There's another. Okay. Oh, I need to give Eunice some heals. What is that? Like four of them? There's another. Oh, yeah, this is a good spot. This is a really good spot. Okay, I totally lost count because we just got so many in a row. But I think that was maybe six. Oh, it's those guards, okay. Then there's like a third guard that she can get to. Oh, there's another. Okay, no oversoul yet.
Too bad the weapons can't come in groups of two where you can get a weapon pair. Then that would make it really fast. Okay, no oversoul yet. Should just be a few more. Ambushed. Come on, I think I only need one or two more weapons. Come on. You are not a weapon. I can hear Lady meowing her head off in the other room. <laughs> Lady, what is it? Yeah? Meow? What is it? I see you. I see you in the hallway. Oh, Oversoul yet? There we go. Okay, let's escape. Okay, now when we go fight Paragon, Paragon will Oversoul, which is exactly what we want. Because <sighs> that's the last one we'll have to get. Alright, I turned off encounters. We're just going to run down to 80 now, because that's the next one. Oh, shit. Not you. Let's go this way. Oh, this one, okay. I don't want to do super speed I'm trying to pass the Tonberry. There we go. Whee! Oh, not that way. This way. Do I still have? Okay. I wanted to make sure I didn't have mascots on. Ooh, one shot. Nice. Waddle on back. Waddle on back. There you go. I love how Yuna has just no fear, like, traversing these things where she could totally fall off at any moment. She's like, whatever. Alright, here we go. Cloister 80. Um, yes, let's return. We need to do exactly what we've been doing before. And we want to check back on the airship to make sure the ones that we have 
oversold are actually counted. So that's going to be Azidaka and Omega Weapon. What are you looking at? Far plane data. Oh yeah, this scene plays because we went to the far plane the and we came I back. It, the more fascinating it gets. There's limitless Apparently we can't skip it. So we play this scene first. Limitless energy. The life force that flows through our planet, I think. With a little work, we could probably extract the energy in a usable form. Don't do it, Shinra. Sweet. Don't do it. It's Mako and it's bad. That's no fun. Well, still, it is something worth shooting for. Think how much spear would change if we ever <laughs> right, to Possum? Maybe one day we could build a city full of light, one that never sleeps. You don't no, want no, that, no. Yuna. You don't want that. Just imagine. But I'll never get to see it, will I? Shinra! Don't make Still can't make skip. You not sad. Right, my bad. Yuna became the real enemy of Final Fantasy VII for real. Shinra, it's all your fault that Sephiroth exists. Not really. Not really, though, my because, bad. like. None of the stuff in Seven would have happened if uh, if the Genova meteor hadn't crashed. So that's really the problem. Uh, okay, we need to look at Shinra's bestiary. So you gotta make sure Azidaka and Omega Weapon are in there. Well, really, we can probably much easier make sure that things. Okay, so chalk. Yes, we still have to do chalk. Uh, Paragon. Yes, critical bug and insect matriarch. Okay, so wait, where is? Yeah, Azidaka. I see Azidaka. Okay, and Omega Weapon. Okay, so we are good. All right, let's head back to Bavel. All right, we're gonna save. Well, actually, let's get ready for Chalk first. We're going to try Berserker Cheese Strat. I don't know if it works on Oversoul version, but we're going to try it. Now let's save. Okay. And I'm going to take just a quick little stretch break. For all watching the recording, it's going to stop now and a new episode is going to be up there tomorrow. Y'all don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. And of course, as always, don't forget to make it a great day.